Hello everyone, in this particular lecture, we are going to learn about one of the most common and most asked question of arrays and the reduce method. That is how to count the frequency of element in an array in JavaScript. Right. So we need to count the frequencies of all the elements that are present in the array. Right. With the help of all the JavaScript concept and mainly with the help of reduce method which is most asked in the interviews right so let's start let's understand that how we can do it right so what we are going to do we will first create an array like this as you can see here right so we are having an array that is apple banana and then orange and yeah these three elements are present and i want the output as apple as basically it is 3 so i need the apple as 3 banana as basically you can see banana is just 2 right so banana as 2 and orange is just 1 right so i want the output of orange as 1 so this is what we want as an output but how can we get it as you can think about it no okay uh, let me solve it for you uh, so it can be easily solved with the help of reduce method right reduce method even interviewer sometimes says that use the reduce method to solve this particular problem and let's understand how we can do it so i'm going to create a variable that is frequency right so inside this frequency we are going to put our reduce method function right so i'm going to write arr arr is representing this particular array dot reduce reduce method inside of it we are going to take two different things that is one is if you know about reduce i think that you know about this uh, variable that is acc what is this it is accumulator right and this is curr that is current right so accumulator will store the calculated value inside of it and current will current will denote the current uh, element of the array in on which it is working right so yeah after that we will put the arrow function like this and inside of this we will write acc bracket means inside the accumulator i am using the current element right current index now if accumulator bracket curr right if it is there or zero if it is searched for that right if it get it else uh, it will give a zero and will make a plus one right now since it is searching that whether accumulator is having a value for that particular element if it has and again it get it then in that particular case it will plus one to that particular number right so let's say that uh, at the first time for the apple for particular apple the value is one because it has searched one now again when it is using this particular element then it will search that whether apple is present or not if it is present then it will make it one to two and similarly it will make it three and we can get that three here right so that's how it is working now after that just return the accumulator that is acc like this right so we have accumulator which is holding all the values so we are actually returning it right and just put here null dependency we don't need that anything inside of it now after that just we need to print this frequency in our console so console dot log bracket inside of this frequency right so let's see that whether it is working or not okay let the terminal open I'm not going to use the website for it. Just write node script.js. Right? Okay. Why it has not given me any answer? We have printed console.log, right? Okay. Let's try it again. Script.js. Okay, fine. It is not giving. Let me uh, just use the website this time. Maybe that's some kind of error be agree okay so we are on the website and now we are going to use the console 
and you can see I'm getting an object here, right? And when I click on it, you can see I'm getting the same result. That is apple is three, banana is two, and the orange is one, right? So this is how we can get the frequency of each and every element which are present in an array using the reduce method, which is the most prominent and efficient method. I explained you that how it's working, right? Try it at you once by yourself also, and we can get the solution. Thank you so much for watching. This is all about today's video. Goodbye.